Hey everybody, welcome back for some more Terranigma. We have awakened. Well, yeah, here we go. Gasp. You, you're awake. How do you feel? I, I, I have to go tell Lord Kamari. Wait, don't try to move yet. But I want to move. Can I, can I? Oh, hey, I'm moving. Those are some blinking lights. You feel fine already? You were in deep sleep for three, three years? Don't exert yourself. Eat well and build your strength. Holy crap, dude, three years? I'm called Luki. I'm glad you're better. Callus, was it? I was shocked when I found you. You were curled up like a newborn baby in unshakable sleep. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna break some shit real quick. <laughs> yeah. When I grow up, I'm becoming a monk to protect Lord Kamari. That's a nice thing to do. It's you, you're finally awake. Pleasant dreams. Really, dude? That's the kind of crap you come up with? <laughs> oh. You finally awoken, Callus. I am Kamari. Until you get better, you should rest at Lie Laja? I, I don't know. <laughs> it's safe here. You will discover what you must do in due time. You can no longer converse with plants and animals. Take this with you in dire danger. Use it to summon me. I can't talk to plants and animals anymore? Aww. Lord Kamari, Master Mehu has arrived. Yes, I know. Please tell him to come. Okay. Alice, there is always a purpose to what occurs in life. Your presence will inevitably be tied to whatever will happen here. Well, this is cool to have humans now. Let's see, uh... Let's see what's up here. Oh, the snowman! Oh, <laughs> Mr. May has been t too many places and tells us neat stories. Okay, studied under the previous Lord Kamari in the past. He has been away on long journeys. It is rare to find him in much. Oh, <gasps> yes. Finally. We slept a long time in darkness and re-emerged in this world. What has happened came about because of something in the past. Everything now is rooted in events from previous lives. Okay. I like this area. It's nice. Hey. Jeez, I used that many. Monk robe. Oh, God. Well, goodbye, money. God. All that money. Yeah, you could have just saved her because you're going to get better armor later. Probably. <laughs> Hopefully I don't need to buy anything else anytime soon. Bye! <laughs> oh god. Mm. Where does this go? Oh! This place is interesting. It's just a random bed. Oh god. I was not expecting that. Oh. Okay. And... 
Where are you from? Please tell me about it. Honestly, I wouldn't even know what to tell you. <laughs> Yaks are important. It carries things, it gives milk and meat, and its dung can be burned as fuel. Nothing goes to waste. Awesome. Ah, oh, back at last. An unfamiliar face. I must first speak with Lord Kamari. If you wish to speak with me, it will have to wait a while. Alright. Let's go to Lord Kamari, I guess. Hopefully we figure out what we gotta do next pretty soon. I'm having a difficult time with my granddaughter. You mean Malin? Even the wisest mind in Laja is no match then. I'm embarrassed, Lord Kamari. What can one do? Spending all her time in a mirage of a town cannot be good for her. Worse, her own power could cause trouble. Huh. You are callous? I have heard about you from Lord Kamari. I was just talking about my granddaughter. She is named Maylin. She used to live in Loran with her parents, but the town fell in war. She lives with me now, but she misses her dead parents, so she spends her days playing in the ruins that were Loran. Where is Loran? In the desert northeast of here, supposedly. However, I could never find it because Maylin obstructed me. Okay. Callus. Your presence here is not without purpose. The arrival of Mayu after your awakening is also significant. Can you lend us your strength for Mayu and Malin's sake? Okay, he just says the same thing. Okay. Uh, I guess we know where we're going next then. Now if I can just get out of here. Are there any other houses or anything? Get the like snowman. Alright, northeast. What is this? Oh, is that the mountain again? Are there any other I see a bridge. Whoa. Can't keep eyes open. Huh? What was that about? Hey, wait a second. Uh, alright then. Nomads. Are you a kidnapper? No. Who are you? Who said you can come in? Get out of here. Why aren't you guys just a freaking ray of sunshine? We are few in number. We have nothing you need. We roam seeking grass and sleep under the stars. We are free. But we always face dangers of nature and outsiders such as our life. This is our grazing land. Don't walk in... Wow. Real courteous people. What do you want? Go take it up with my husband outside. Who are you? Who said you can come in here? Uh, well, looks like I'm not well welcomed here. Uh, do, 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 do. Hey. And that goes back outside. <laughs> huh. Well, 
there's that person again. Did I? Oh crap. Looks like I have to follow this person like exactly. slow or something. <laughs> Good God. Alright, let's try this one more time. I know I'm getting encoding, so this is not good. What's that about? Oh. Laron. Well, we made it to Laron. And uh, I'm going to end things off right here. And uh, we'll check out Laron in the next video. So, if you guys enjoyed this, leave a like, comment, share, and subscribe, and come on back for some more Terra Enigma. And, uh, hello. Ron is small, but we have plans to make it bigger. We plan to build more homes in the east and north. Wait, wasn't this place destroyed? <laughs> Mystery! <laughs> See you guys in the next episode. Take care. Bye-bye.